everybody. The Golden Globes have been serving up fashion inspiration for decades now, and our next guest is here to prove that it's not just for the red carpet. Mm -hmm. She's gonna highlight some of her favorite looks from past Golden Globes that we can't only incorporate into our everyday wardrobes now, but they're also a sneak peek at some of the biggest trends of 2024 ahead. Welcome back to the show for the new year. So that was Erica <laughs> Work. Yeah. Yeah. All right, so let's dive into it, Erica. This red carpet retrospective with Michelle Yeoh from last year's Golden Globes, Oof. where she won Best Actress for oh. Everything, Everywhere, All at Once. Her blue sequin number made all of the best dress lists, including yours, Erica. Yes, she looked so good in that Armani Privé. It was such a moment for her, as it should be. Mm -hmm. And we're going to be seeing a lot of these gorgeous, deep, blue shades as Ooh. we work into 2024, including into the spring and summer season. Oh, All right. cool. Okay. So let's see how you translated that. Sam, come on out. This is... I Love. This navy blue. Listen, Subtle, as much as I elegant. love to do a red carpet Kinda gown, blue. you know, we're not, we're not. Oh, oh, we wear every day. We wear every day. So we're going to take, you know, the, the ideas of the red carpet, we're going to translate them into everyday wear. And I think we've really nailed it with Sam's mm. look. Uh, we're working with all different shades of blue, but I really feel like navy is going to be the color, the neutral color <gasps> of the year, I which it. I'm really excited about. Yeah, because also like navy goes great with all the other neutrals. It goes great with white, with cream, with browns with camels, with blacks. I mean, it's just so easy to wear. And and you can also do it in a really beautiful monochromatic way, which is what I did here. So we're seeing lots of those deep shades of blue, starting off with this really beautiful sweater from Banana Republic done in a wool cashmere blend. So super cozy, comfortable, perfect for the winter season. And then you can also think about your denim as part of a yeah. shade of blue, right? So that's what we did here. And I'm loving this new trend we're seeing for denim with the split hem. It's a oh. really great way to like sort of oh, yeah. dip your toe into more of a boot cut or flare style without going all of the way. Mm -hmm. And also a great way to highlight some shoes. I did a really beautiful overcoat from Zara, also in navy. We also accessorized Sam's looks. We did a statement earring. These are from Banana Republic, even with those beautiful wow. shades of navy oh, and blue. Those are fancy. Really, really pretty. <laughs> wow. It really amps it up, right? Yeah. And then we finish it off with this Croc inspired bag from IE Co. And then finish it off with some really beautiful glossy boots from Lynn. Interval also done in navy. So like great. Oh, oh, so good. Do you love this? This yeah. is a majestic yeah. moment. Yeah. Thank, you, Thank you, Sam. Thank you. Yeah. Also, spoiler alert, Shades of Blue is the sequel to Shades of Grey. <laughs> <laughs> Next up, we have Julia Roberts in 1991 wearing oh, a chic pinstripe iconic. dress, right? Yeah. She's speaking to the press after winning Best Actress for her role in Pretty Women, Woman. So what's so great about this is I love how trends are so cyclical, right? Because mm -hmm. now we're seeing the oversized shoulder pads, we're seeing the pinstripe. Business core was such a big trend in the fall. We're going to continue to see that style and silhouette as we make our way into 2024. Love that. I love it. Okay, yeah, and so, so we have uh, Cynthia here to show us how to get in on the look, and so come on out. Woo! Oh, very sexy. <laughs> about like what I want. This is my 2024 energy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. this is 2024 yeah. energy. Yeah, is is I wanted to show you guys that, you know, a pinstripe suit is not just for the office. It can, in fact, be for a night out. So here I've styled this really great oversized blazer and wide leg trouser, which of course is synonymous with the business wear trend that we're seeing for 2024 with a sexy bustier yes. to really oh. elevate this look for date night. Woo. So, so yeah. sexy, so good. Days. <laughs> and what's great about this suit is you're getting both pieces for under $100 from H&M. And then we kept things sort of like elevated with a little bit of gold detailing. We did a statement earring in gold for just $14.99 from H&M. Oh, nice. We then added this really beautiful structured bag also from H&M. And then we finished it off with a classic pump with a little bit of bling, you know, just to keep that elevated feel going. Wow. Oh, Sorry, where does one buy something like um, the Boussier? Yeah, the <laughs> also from H&M. And it's on sale right now for $20. Oh, my so get on it. Get on it. <laughs> Thank you, Chen. Thank you. <laughs> Jess is taking notes. Taking notes. To like a business meeting? Yeah. <laughs> yes. Okay, moving on to 
Lupita Nyong'o from 2014 in this fabulous oh, red yeah. dress. It was her first time on the Golden Globes red carpet and she definitely made a statement. None of us can forget it. This was one of my favorite looks on the Golden Globes carpet mm -hmm. ever. It's <laughs> custom Ralph Lauren. It's mm -hmm. so gorgeous. She really, I feel like this was her moment where she really took on the whole sort of fashion hat, yes. if you will, moving forward in her career. And she's had so many amazing fashion moments since. And thankfully, red is going nowhere. It is going to be a huge <gasps> trend for the love rest that. of the year, which love I am that. thrilled love about. Yeah, we love that. Well, I can't wait to see what you put together. So, Candice, come on out. Woo! talking about uh, Red really all season long. Yeah. I mean, we yeah. started it off like season, what was season 11 talking about Red. Well, it's yeah. gonna be a huge color as we move into 2024. All shades of Red, which I'm so excited about. Mm -hmm. So I wanted to do sort of a monochromatic vibe. We started off with this gorgeous coat from Centler. Underneath, I styled with this beautiful cable knit sweater from Reitman's for just $29.95. And then finished off with a satin inspired silk skirt from Dynamite for just $30. Guys, the sales right now are so good. So you definitely yeah. wanna jump on these now, especially because you're gonna be seeing these trends throughout the next year, so you're gonna be wearing a ton of them. And then we sort of added a bit of gold jewelry just to sort of warm up the look a little bit with a statement earring from Pretty Little Thing. These are under $10. And then we finished off with some cream accessories with her beautiful little bag there, also on sale from Zara for just 20, and these gorgeous cream boots also on sale yeah. from Zara. That's great. Wow. Suppose a person's not comfortable with the full red look, what piece should they invest in? Ooh. Ooh. You know, right? I love a red coat. I feel yeah, like a pop of color, especially because our winters, we wear our coats for so many months. <laughs> so it is nice to inject that bold pop of color. And with red, again, similar to navy, it goes with every other neutral yeah. in your wardrobe, so it's really easy to mix and match. I love, I love that. that. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Well, let's close it off. Last but certainly not least, let's go all the way back to 1999, Angelina Jolie. Oh, so she graced the oh Golden God. Globes in uh, this silver right? sequin dress. She actually went on to win Best Actress for her role in Gia. So good. And you know, the 90s was all about like sort of that slip classic timeless silhouette. Wow. And now we're seeing a lot of that uh, even now today. And we're also seeing, of course, metallics being a big trend. Mm -hmm. So I'm really excited that it's going to be a trend that we're gonna see all year long. Okay, so now we're bringing it into 2024. Yvonne, come on out. Woo! It's actually a slip dress. I was inspired by Angelina Jolie's slip dress look, so I wanted to recreate that look with this beautiful slip dress. This is from Dynamite, only $50. It's done in this gorgeous sort of gunmetal color, but as you can see, anytime the light hits it, it reflects a different shade. So it's a really cool colorway, and that way you can also mix your metals, which is exactly what I did here with this look. We styled this oversized blazer out of this beautiful wide belt with the gold buckle, and then we also added gold jewelry on top in her earrings from Jenny Bird as well. So so don't oh, yeah. be afraid to mix your metals. You could also do silver when you're working with sort of gunmetal shade because it really acts Can quite either way. Exactly. Then I finished it off with a velvet textured bag just because we're working with a lot of black here. Oh, so okay. it's always good to mix it up with different textures and then finish it off with a classic black boot. I think she looks divine. Yeah. Yeah. YouTube channel after the show. Hey there, what did you think? Drop your comments below and join the conversation. And don't forget to like and subscribe so you can find more on everything from food and fashion to pop culture and current events. See you soon.